if you and I are in conflict, right, it's as if we put ourselves on the opposite ends of the same line. And my aim is to prove that you're wrong and to shift you towards me. And his aim is exactly opposite, to prove that I'm wrong and shift me towards him. Right? Notice that we engage in conflict with the desire to stand still. So we engage with conflict with the aim to win but not learn. Because your brain only learns when it moves. So what would happen if we actually entered conflict with a question rather than the answer? And now that you know how perception works, you're foolish, literally foolish, if you enter conflict with knowing instead of not knowing with a question instead of an answer. With the aim not to convince, but with the aim to understand. And to understand does not necessarily mean validate. How can you know if you can validate someone if you don't actually understand them first? Right? And in doing so, don't shift, right? expand. The aim is not to go from A to B. The aim is to go from the line to the square, to the cube, to expand your space of possibility. Because that's what it is to be open. That's what it is to be adaptable, to have more degrees of freedom at any point in time, rather than just towards or away.